All right, in today's video, we're gonna make a headshot of ourselves and we're gonna put it into a circle frame in Canva. So the first thing you're gonna wanna do is have your headshot. So let's see, I gotta find my headshot in here. And we're gonna upload it into a Canva. Okay, so hopefully you have a headshot. If you don't have one, take a picture of yourself real quick. And then I'm gonna name this Dina AI Blue. And then we're gonna download that. You're gonna click that right share button to the top right hand side and download it. If you want a clear background, you can use a PNG, but I want that blue because I think it really makes my picture pop out. Okay, so that's downloaded. Next, what you're gonna wanna do is create a new design. So uh, we've got that saved, but I like to save everything into my folders. So I'm gonna save it into my AI apps folder. Okay, then we're gonna click the hamburger menu up on the top left side. And then we're gonna create design. It'll also be a thousand by a thousand pixels. And then in the elements tab, we're gonna click there and type the word frame into the search bar. You can use any shape that you want here. You can use a rounded rectangle or a rounded square or circle but I like the circle. I think it looks really sharp and modern. Okay, so then what you're gonna wanna do is click the Uploads tab on the left column in that sidebar, and you're gonna upload your headshot that you just made, and it's gonna be over here in your images. Then you're gonna just drag that into that circle, and here is your circle image. Now you can download it, you can share, but you may, you want to make sure it has a transparent background or it's going to be a circle with a white square around it. So make sure to check this transparent background box and then click download. All right, so let's go ahead and open that up and see how it looks. Oh, that's the wrong one. Oh, I need to name this. So let's go ahead and name it, if I can. Okay, so now we're gonna click Share and Download. Make sure it's transparent, and then click the Download button. If it doesn't start downloading, if you don't see it go into your download folder, um, click that purple Click Here button right in the bottom right-hand corner of the download area, and that's gonna make it populate into your downloads. All right, cool, you can see this is transparent now, and it looks really good. Okay, so we're gonna save that, and that's how you create a transparent headshot with a circle frame around it, transparent background. All right, I'll see you in the next video.